Welcome into Charles Schwab Field where day two of the Big Ten Tournament is underway. Nebraska baseball playing in the only first round game of the day against Rutgers, a team they've never faced in this tournament before. Now there are just two Husker players on this roster that have experienced playing in the Big Ten Tournament. It comes from fifth year pitchers Kyle Perry and Shea Shaneman who both say the key to doing well this week is simple, just win the day. Nebraska taking that mindset into today's first round game. Bottom of the first, Charlie Fisher. He launches one out to left, a three-run home run. Fisher's seventh homer on the season. Chuck goes deep at the Chuck to set the momentum for the Big Red. Nebraska takes an early 3-0 lead. Top of the fifth now. Rutgers trying to even it up, down two. Evan Slight drives a two-out, two-run double to right center. That ties it up three to three. In the seventh, Rutgers out in front. Andy Axelson hits a sack fly to right field to give the Scarlet Knights a 6-3 lead. Still plenty of time left for those Huskers, and they're not letting them get away with that. Gabe Swanson hits a no doubter 402 feet out, a three-run shot, exactly what the Huskers needed. The Big Red are literally jumping for joy as they run home. That ties the game up 6-6. Six to six. Nebraska gets to tack on a couple more walks from there. They hold Rutgers to just one more run to win the day together, defeating the Scarlet, Light, Scarlet Knights 9-7. to seven. Great group of guys, um, talent-wise, but also we're very close. So just knowing that every day, as long as we go in and compete, um, and lay it on the line for each other. I think that's the biggest thing. And at the end of the day, uh, perfect or not, um, just knowing that we can win games without doing everything correctly. So also knowing that at the end of the day, if we don't do everything correctly, we still have a chance to win just in the sense of bouncing back, picking each other up. There were some tough innings, um, whether it was not punching home runs or on the bump as well. But just knowing that you got each other's back was the biggest thing today and knowing that we still can win that game even when we went down. A very big deal for those Huskers winning their first game. Coach Bull says he hopes this win today can set the momentum for the rest of the week. The Huskers have a big competition tomorrow night facing top seed in Maryland right here at 6 o'clock. We'll be there to give you all the coverage, but for now, I'm Lauren Michelson reporting live from Charles Schwab Field.